Okay, this is day four of construction in the basement, matrix wall systems. So this area is done here now. They fully cut out the, uh, the escape windows. You can see the panels have been uh, sealed with mud and, uh, and a bead. Set up the projector to kind of give us an idea what it would look like. This will of course be ceiling mounted. And that's part of the finishing. The screen looks really good. It'll look really great with a uh, with a proper screen. And then over here, uh, they remove some lights. So this room is actually larger than I was expecting here. This is going to be can easily fit the air hockey table and then some uh, door to storage. These will be French doors here, and that'll eventually be a bedroom someday. Uh, took the wall back from this pole. Um, all the way back to here. That's what got me the extra square footage uh, that I wanted. This is Optoma. It's about a 15-foot throw. This is right about 15. Uh, I haven't measured the screen, but it'll go somewhere up here. Bar will be here in between these two poles, 11 feet, uh, with a granite overhang. So the view from from the uh, from the bar while making drinks for people, uh, you can still see the screen and actually if I go all the way to the back so even if you're not in the dedicated theater area you are still pretty much uh, you know the the seats still pretty good I mean it's not bad um, originally on this wall I wanted to do a two three five to one aspect ratio ultra wide uh, this is obviously 16 by 9 but uh, the option is still available to me. Um, just kind of waiting to see where the, the market on projectors comes out as far as getting lens memory. Uh, so in the meantime, I went with this, an Optoma 141X. Um, great projector, got it for $530. Um, and to me, it's the perfect kind of projector if you're not willing to spend thousands and thousands of dollars on a 1080 projector when 4K is a few years down the road. Uh, so I gave up two two three five dot one for that, but uh, the screen is so huge, I don't think it matters. Um, this is just my Fire TV hooked up here. Uh, let me just play something in Plex real quick. Um, the little built-in speaker is pretty good, so uh, when this is done, I'll be able to, and they finish the ceiling, I'll be able to mount it. Um, and uh, have a pretty decent workaround, especially with a nice 0.8 gain screen so I can keep the darks with the contrast. Uh, the plans for the AV is right around here. They'll be conduit. And the power plugs and stuff will actually be on the other side where I'll have a shelf with the Emotiva uh, separates, 7.1, and then the UMC 200 preamp. Um, room for the speakers here, probably gonna go with the SVS primes. Um, and then there will be two power plugs facing frontwards for the dual PB2000s I'm looking at, or or maybe PB1000s, depending on what I want to go with. Uh, and then plenty of options for surround uh, in the ceiling. Unfortunately, I won't be able to do any ear level stuff easily, um, so that's a compromise I'm going to have to do. But um, all right, so four full days in, electricians come tomorrow. Um, the, they finish up. The, the floor is going to be polished concrete, so that's going to be pretty cool. And uh, that's it.